Good morning, good morning once again, boys and girls at home, our parents and guardians and friends from wherever you're watching us from this morning. Welcome to our service once again. We are happy to come into your homes and bring you the gift of the word of God. Can we please start with a word of prayer? Dear Lord Jesus, we thank you for this day and we thank you for the gift of your word. As your word is brought to us today, we ask that you open our hearts to understand you and give us a teachable spirit so that we may love you more, know you more, and continue walking in obedience to your word. We give you thanks in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Amen. 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 Welcome, Amen. children. Hey, All right. hey, uh -huh. guys. What? I have some interesting <laughs> story. <laughs> what? Uh -huh. Children, you know what happened last week? Uh -huh. uh, actually, in the course of this week, mm -hmm. there's a child by uh -huh. the name Michelle Howie. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I have a relative. Uh -huh. You have a relative? In fact, that name reminds me of my niece uh -huh. called Howie. Uh -huh. So Michelle called Tim Red. Yes. She so called just, just to tell us that Tim Green yeah. is painting the whole city green. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been this excited. Okay, wait a minute. Did you, did you receive a phone call? I received a call <laughs> yes. from uh, Michelle Howie. Yes. Yes. He's only five getting to six. Yeah. And she said she loves Tim Tuk Tuk. <laughs> but <laughs> the city uh -huh. is painted red. Ah, yeah. no. Yes. <laughs> uh, uh, children. It's good when you see younger children fighting amongst themselves. <laughs> you must remember well the this 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 country. Yes. You guys are talking about the city. <laughs> the country and beyond yes. is all orange. Okay? But anyway, we <laughs> but it, <laughs> just allow me to encourage it, my team, eh? uh -huh. Please now next time please uh -huh. call Team Orange uh -huh. and just tell them how we are painting the, the nation green. Thank you. Team yeah. Red, don't be left behind. We are the winners. We don't have to shout it, yeah. but we are the winners. But anyway, we are getting so excited because the momentum that hey. has been set yes. is just amazing. Yes. We are looking forward to the day we are going to arrive at a thousand children, Team Orange, yes. a, thousand a thousand children, children Team, team red, red, and a thousand children, Team, team Green. green. Yes. Actually, Team Orange will be a thousand and one. <laughs> okay, but anyway, hey. <laughs> but we are so grateful. Thank you for the support. Thank you for the many people who write to us and they say that we are a blessing to them. You are also a blessing to us when you give us your feedback. Mm. So we encourage you. And there is something that people now need to start doing again. Teacher Masi. In fact, yes. we're going to ask children and their parents to start taking photos mm. of them wearing. Yes. Let us see how many greens and yes. reds. Yes. God, you will <laughs> see. All the children who are going to make photos, who are going to send us photos, Team, team two, Orange. Two, two green. Yeah. Team tuk, tuk, team red, take photos so we shall be counting, yeah? But, uh, so anyway, and the when photos will be sent to our email address. Yes, mm -hmm. that is being displayed right yes. now on, on there. Screen. Yes. Yeah. So again, as we get into the Bible lesson for today, we will have a, a, a time of praise and worship. And of yes. course, today we will be singing it in an African way, okay? Amen. You know, there's an interesting song that is sung here in Kenya. And this is how it goes, yeah? I need to get my... Yeah, in Africa we use this. When Jesus came down He came down from heaven When He landed He landed in Israel When there was trouble He came down to Africa So we must praise Him Praise Him in an African way When Jesus came down he came down from heaven when he landed, he landed in Israel. When there was trouble, he came down to Africa. So we must praise him, praise him in an African way. yes, 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 Murinda wanje, 
Yes, Uganda, 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 So we must praise him. Praise him in an African way. Goro ya kwa nira kena. Goro ya kwe gatuma tuma. Goro ya kwe kaigua wega kaigua wega. Netodo wa muhono kia. Goro ya kwa, goro ya kwa nira kena. Goro ya kwe gatuma tuma. Goro ya kwe kaigua wega kaigua wega. So we must praise him, praise him in an African way. Gima lomba, ewanu watiyo. Gima lomba, gima polo lomba. Ewanu watiyo, nengima. Gima lomba, ewanu wati. Gima lomba, gima polo lomba. Ewanu watiyo. Oh, ahero yesu. Ewanu watiyo. Aero Yesu ni kesho wara no no Ewanu watiyo nangima Aero Yesu Ewanu watiyo Aero Yesu ni kesho changa no no Ewanu watiyo nangima And so we must praise him Praise him in an African way All the other gods They are the works of men But you are the most high God there is none like you. All the other gods, they are the works of men. But you are the most high God. There is none like you. Jehovah, you are the most high. You are the most high God. Sing Jehovah, you are the most high. You are the most high God. You are good and your mercy is forever. Hallelujah. You are good and your mercy is forever. Hallelujah. Jehovah, you are the most high. Jehovah, you are the most high God. Jehovah, you are the most high. One more time, sing Jehovah, you are the most high, you are the most high God, Jehovah, you are the most high, you are the most high God. Yay, that was a nice song. Yes. And the whole of this month, we will be placing our lives in the hands of God, because we know that with a loving Father, we will not fail. Hey, Tikamazi, by the way, I like the way you are doing the, uh, you know. The reggae. The Christian reggae. Hey, that was really nice. So today, I want you to look at your friend and say, I place my life in your hands. So you tell I me. place my life in, in your hands. Yes. Yeah, so, oh, it's not you're telling. Yes, <laughs> no, no. you're telling. Yeah. Yes. So let's say the Lord, I place my life in your hands. I place my life in your hands, Lord. My life in your hands, yeah, not your hands in my life. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so let's go together, Teacher Moses. Hey. Come on, if you're there, everybody stand up and sing this song with us. I place my life in your hands. I place my life in your hands. With a loving Father, I won't fail. With a loving Father, I won't fail. Ignite in me your passion. Ignite in me your passion. To set the world ablaze. Set the world through the fire, through the storm. I will go. Amazing God on my side. Amazing God on my side. What a revelation I would hide. What a revelation I would hide. Here I am, use me. Here I am. I will come without delay. I will come with through the fire, through the storm. I will go. Hallelujah to the great I am, my redeemer, everlasting one. Where you send me, I will go. With your power and your love, I will go. Block. Woo. Hey. 
I stand amazed at your love. I stand amazed at your love. How far you went to set me free. How far you went to set me free. Take this offering. Take this offering. My mind, my hands, and both my feet. My mind, my hands, and through the fire, through the storm, I will go. Hallelujah to the great I am, my Redeemer, everlasting one. Where you send me, I will go with your power and your love. I will Hallelujah go. to the great I am, my Redeemer. Where you send me, I will go with your power and your love. I will go. Woo! And through the fire, through the storm, I will go. Amen. Uh -huh. Now, did you tell your friend that we must have this song? No, I, I, I was afraid. <laughs> you are afraid. So anyway, now we I are going to send, I'm going to give you a letter <laughs> to go and take to him. But that is a beautiful song. Yeah. And the Lord says he will send us. Yes. We are sure that he will be with us to the very end. Amen. In the month of, um, in the month of September, September, I was going mm. to say in the month of October, in this month of September, yes. we are going through the life of a, one of the characters of the Bible, and his name is Daniel. Daniel. Daniel, okay? And of course, we will be building up a certain story that will take us to the month of October when we shall have the World's Day of the Children's, Children's World Day, Day of, of Prayer. prayer. Okay? Mm. So we are focusing on trusting God, putting our trust in the Lord. Lord yeah. And our Bible lesson for today is going to be taken from the book of Daniel, Daniel. Mm -hmm. and it's going to be read by Cindy Wamboi. Now listen, my, the, sister, Wamboy. the sister who follows me is called hey. Wamboi. Hey, Uncle I'm Paul, Paul. my name is Wamboi. Hello. <laughs> Let alone a sister. Okay. I am Wamboi. So, you have one. I have one. Okay. <laughs> Uncle Paul has relatives. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Wamboi. Wamboi, go ahead. And, my sister, go ahead. <laughs> My name is Fiva Amani Ouma. I am eight years old. The word of today comes from Daniel chapter 3, verse 19 to 29. It says, Then Nebuchadnezzar lost his temper, and his face turned red with anger at Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. So he ordered the furnace to be heated seven times hotter than usual. And he commanded the strongest men and his army to tie the three men up and throw them into the blazing furnace. So they tied them up fully dressed, shirts, robes, caps, and all and threw them into the blazing furnace. Now, because the king had given strict orders to the furnace, he, he made extremely hot. The flames burnt up the guards who took the men to the furnace. Then Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, still tied up, fell into the heart of the blazing fire. Suddenly, Nebuchadnezzar left his feet in amazement. He asked the officials, didn't we tie up the three men, the three men and throw them into the blazing furnace? They answered, yes, we did, your majesty. Then why do I see four men walking in the fire? He asked, they are not tied up and they show no sign of being hurt. 
and the fourth one looks like an angel. So Nebuchadnezzar went up to the door of the blazing furnace and called out, Shadrach, Meshach, Abednego, servants of the supreme God, come out. And they came out at once. All the princes, governors, nutrient governors, and the officials of the king gathered to look at the three men who had not been harmed by the fire. Their hair was not signed, their clothes were not burnt, and there was no smell of smoke on them. The king said, Praise the God of Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. He sent an angel to rescue these men who serve and trust him. Disobeyed, they disobeyed my orders and risked their lives rather than bow down and worship any god except their own. And now I command if anyone of any nation, race or language speaks dis disrespectfully from the god of Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, he is to be torn limb from limb and his house is to be a pile of ruins there is no other god who can rescue like this that's the word of the lord okay and all of us together thanks, thanks be, be to god, god. Hey, Hey, let's go. Calamanda, pa 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 pa. Calamanda, pa 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 pa. Señorita, pa 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 pa. Boom. Well done, Nimsik. Well done. Hey, one boy, you've done it so well. You know, even me, I know one boy. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, for sure. So today's story is going to be built from what happened last Sunday. Now, last Sunday, remember, we talked about the boys who were taken to to Babylon from from Israel, yes. and when they got there, they refused to be in the same WhatsApp group. <laughs> yeah, they, yes. they refused to have fellowship and, and, and fellowship mm -hmm. with, with the king. Mm. And you remember we said that uh, during time of uh, uh, eating together, it means that you have opened up your hearts to this person and you're actually walking in communion. Mm. Today's story is actually going to show us the real character of Peter Moses' friend. I. Oh yeah, those were your friends. Which friend are you talking about? Nebuchadnezzar. Ati? Yeah. I. <laughs> yes. That can't be my friend, Buana. Oh, you. Moses, the yeah. way you love friends with big names. Yeah. You own them every time you hear big names. Ah, uh, no, That's your no, friend. not, not the, that one. You see what he's made of. Okay, you rejected Nebuchadnezzar. Ah, uh, no, no, not okay, that one. Okay, after, after you knew that he was a, he was an idol worshiper. Yeah, me only my friends are straight. Eh? They are good people. Yes. <laughs> so anyway, children, this is what happened. Yes. Um, the King Nebuchadnezzar. You remember we said that he was an idol worshiper. Mm. He did not worship the same God as, as um, you remember the names of the the, the four friends, yeah. Yes. yes. Okay. <clears throat> the first one was Shadrach. Shadrach was a nickname. Oh, I see you does. Said you want he was the, the original. The, the original one, name. Eh, the first one was? I know. Eh? Eh? Ananaya. Eh, I thought you had to eh. say. Eh. Ananaya. The eh. second one was? Mishael. Mishael. Yes. Eh, eh. And the third one was? Azaria. Eh, you get that. No. Yeah. Hey, and of I course, uh, Daniel had been called? <laughs> eh. Belshazzar. Belshazzar. You see, that was a uh, bit heavy, eh? Hello, yeah. Like Nebu. What? So anyway, yeah. So anyway. <laughs> yes. So the, um, um, where was I with the story? Uh, names. The names. The names. The yeah. four friends. The three friends of da da yeah, David. Yeah. So they had been given. They had Daniel, been. They, 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 the, the, the three friends of Daniel. They had been given names, mm -hmm. and they had accepted to do a number of things. They had accepted to be taught the ways of uh, the Babylon. They had accepted to, um, to even their new names, mm -hmm. but they had refused to have fellowship with, with the king. Mm -hmm. So anyway, in this particular story, uh, the true character of Nebuchadnezzar was revealed. So God, when, uh, when, the, when the four friends, uh, Daniel, Hananiah, 
Mishael and Azaria mm. refused to eat from the king's table, God blessed them. Mm. And you remember we said that they became <coughs> significant <coughs> like our friend. Yeah, yes. healthy, healthy. healthy they people. added some centimeters. Some, some centimeters, <laughs> yeah. And then, um, and then he blessed them with exceeding knowledge. Wow. They had capacity mm -hmm. to, to do difficult things. And then mm -hmm. he gave them the knowledge to interpret dreams. Wow. Now, because Dreams? of that, eh, wow. the king spotted, Dan he gave Daniel mm. the, the, the gift of interpreting dreams, okay? Wow. So, uh, because of that, the king uh, spotted Daniel and he made him a very, very uh, senior mm. in, in Babylon. Then Daniel influenced the king uh -huh. to bring his, um, to, to make his three friends governors. 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 Hey. Wow. So now Wait. Daniel was like the um, state, he's called a uh, state house state controller. State house controller. controller. Yes. yes. Yeah. I was looking for that one. Yeah. Hey. Daniel was like, was the controller. Mm -hmm. And then his three friends were governors. Governors. Okay. So they were Gover actually having uh -huh. some very serious hey. positions. Then uh, the king, uh, one day he woke up in the morning and decided, I am going to construct a god. A god? a god? Can he God can a god be constructed? A he god. decided that uh, the, 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 he was going to, to, to construct the biggest, the tallest, the mightiest, the most expensive god. And he said, This is now going to be the god of my whole country. Okay. Hmm. This god was was quite something. Mm. He was 90 feet tall. 90, 90 feet do you tall. Know, do you know how tall Uncle Paul is? Tell us. Tell us. Six feet. Oh, six feet. Okay. Mm. So uh -huh. Uncle Paul is six feet. Eh? Mm -hmm. So 90 feet eh, is like Uncle Paul times um, 13. Mm, Uncle Paul. Uh. What? Your math. What? It's outside. <laughs> Your math is outside. Yes. What? It is not 13. It's what? You should have asked Matthew's calculator. Yeah. It is 15. It is three. It <laughs> yeah, is yeah. Fifteen. Yes. Children, it is fifteen. Yeah, yes. <laughs> fifteen times six. Yeah. It took, took. I'm Actually, I was just trying to test whether you guys know the math. I'm so. telling you. Know math. Anyway, my math is inside. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, the god was actually ninety feet. It's like Uncle Paul. Uh, nine, 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 nine. Fifteen, 15, 15 of times. us. Yes. Oh, yeah. Wow. And then the and then the the breath. Yeah. Uh -huh. The the. The the, the, width. the significance, eh? uh -huh. The significance was like uh, was nine feet. Another nine, nine feet. So it's like Uncle Paul sleeping like this, eh? Yeah? Yeah. And then another half Uncle Paul. Hey. Wow. So he was a tall god, and then he was a very um, uh, healthy or mm -hmm. sorry unhealthy. <laughs> <laughs> he was a very unhealthy god. Yes. So then, and he was made of pure gold. Gold? Pure yes. gold. That is so expensive. So now, this guy is said, yeah, the Nebuchadnezzar oh. said, yeah, from today onwards, all people, once this God is constructed, everybody in my kingdom is going to worship this God. <laughs> and then he did not even uh, give the secret to, he did not tell uh, Daniel what he was about to do. Okay. So he, anyway, he went and constructed, and then he decided, the day I'm going to, to, to show everybody uh, the new God, um, I'm going to declare it a public holiday. Mm. Wow. Okay? Wow. And okay. then he, he said he was going to bring all the musicians, all of them, of Babylon. Akina Moses. Akina Moses. Oh, no. <laughs> me, me, I would have remained home. You'd have remained home, eh? But yeah, all musicians. Anyway, listen, yeah. He decided that he was going to bring together all the musicians. Those who play flute, those who play the guitar, those who play the harp and the violin, those who play, what other instruments do people play? Kayamba. Kayamba. Was Kayamba? Yes. Yes, you know, he, anyway. Congas. Oh, oh yeah, even mm -hmm. this one. Yes. He brought all the musicians together. Mm -hmm. And then he says at the count of three, three, two, one, I want all the instrumentalists to blast out. Pa! And the minute that happens, mm -hmm. everybody in the kingdom should go down and worship the new God. What? what? Ah, yeah. what? So now, uh, Daniel was the controller, so he was in state house. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm. So him, he knew he was not going to do that. Mm. His friends were out in the, in the counties. Mm. So they also decided, you know, for us, there is only one God. There is no way we are going to 
worship this God. Mm. So anyway, when the king erected the, 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 the new God, mm. and then he brought together all the musicians, mm -hmm. and then he said at the count of three, two, two one, one. Pa, pa, ra, pa, pa. Everybody in the kingdom went down on their feet and they worshipped the new God. Oh my goodness. Apart from three. Apart eh, from three. four people. Four. four. Daniel. 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 Ananiah. 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 Mishael. 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 And Azariah. Ah. And Azariah. But you see, Daniel was in state house, mm -hmm. so nobody actually discovered mm -hmm. that he had not bowed down oh, yeah. because he was working in his office. Yes. But his friends, Azariah, Mishael, and Hananiah, the governors, the governors, the governors uh -huh. they yes. were working out in the field. Mm -hmm. And so when they heard the noise, all the people around them discovered that they actually did not bow down. Mm -hmm. And they went to them and they said, wait, wait, don't be funny. Mm -hmm. Come on, even if you are the governor, you must bow down to, uh, to, to the God of our king. Mm -hmm. And they said, uh, listen, yeah, we, we respect you guys. We have your names. We have studied your culture, <laughs> but on this one mm. is a no, no. Mm -hmm. We will not bow down to, you, to the God of the king. And they were like, what are you trying to tell us? Are you trying to tell us that your God is more superior than our God? Shame on you. Mm. You have been hired by the king, and now you're coming to pretend here. You will bow down. And they said, listen, mm. with all respect, we will. And they were like, okay, fine. Yeah? You think you're tougher than the king. So they ran to the king. And they said, your excellency, mm -hmm. yeah, your majesty, can you imagine the three governors that you, you brought from, from Israel, mm -hmm. they have refused to bow down to, 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 to the new God. And uh, King Nebuchadnezzar was angry. He was like, what? Mm. Yeah? Uncle Paul, you know, I really hate Kiere Heres. <laughs> Are you saying about Kiere Heres? No, uh, that man is reminding me of that other You remember the other story we, we gave for the workers? <laughs> Yes. That's the worker, Kirehere Pere Pere. Oh, yes, the yes, one yes. who got the same. Oh, these guys who were to tell the king, yeah? <laughs> that one reminds me. That yeah, one. yeah. So the king went and said that he, he says like that, what? You, you mean, you mean there are people who have refused to bow down to this God? I said, not just people, mm -hmm. governors, leaders, Why? and they have refused. And the king was angry and he said, can you bring them here? Mm. So they were brought before the king. Mm -hmm. And I said, what is this nonsense that I'm hearing? that you will not bow down to my God. Mm. And they were like, you know, your excellency, we, we respect you. Mm. you. You gave us new names, we accepted. You taught us, and the king did not even wait for them to, to finish and said, just shut up. Mm. Listen, listen to me very carefully. Anyone who is not going to bow down to this God is going to be thrown into a furnace. You are going to be burnt alive. And it doesn't matter who you are, what you think, it doesn't matter what you believe in, you will die in the furnace. Uh, and they said, listen to us, eh? please kindly listen to us. You see, we serve only one true God. That's why you say amen. 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 <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. They said we serve only one true God. One. Amen. There is no way we are going to bow down to your king, to, to your God. And, 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 then, and the king said, yeah, so you think that you cannot bow down to my God. Mm -hmm. Do you think your God is going to save you from my fire? <laughs> they said, listen, king, yeah, mm -hmm. this is not about fire. It's not about the furnace. Mm -hmm. Our God is able to save us from that fire. But even if he does not save us, mm -hmm. imagine we will not bow down. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Those they, are my boys. Those are your boys, eh? <laughs> they were yeah. very courageous. Now I can tell you there was no hallelujah in that place. Eh? Uh -huh. The king got mad. Mm. And he said, now, let's teach these disobedient governors a lesson. Whoa. I want you to go and make the furnace seven times hotter. Seven? Hey. Yes. Wow. I want to make sure that by the time they get in there, they will just start melting like snow. Wow, wow, wow. wow so wow. guys went and made the furnace so hot. Mm. And then the king ordered for, for the strongest men in the army to go and tie ropes around Hananiah, Mishael, and Azariah. Mm. And then he commanded them to go and get them, uh, to go and have them thrown into, into the furnace. Mm. Now, the fire was so hot 
that as the soldiers went to throw them inside the fire, even before they got, um, they got into, uh, they got to the furnace. Yes. The heat that was coming from the furnace was so hot, it actually killed the strong soldiers. Whoa. Killed them? It was terrible. That was wow. hot. But now, the most amazing thing happened. What? When Hananiah was thrown into the fire, Vuh. Vuh. and then Michelle was thrown into the fire, Vuh. and then uh, Azaria was thrown into the fire, Vuh. Vuh. they would run into the fire and then stand up, and the thing that would happen is the ropes that was tying them would fall off. Hallelujah. The second one would stand up, the ropes would fall down. The third one, and then they started walking around. Walking. That is strange. You know, and they were talking to, you know, they were having fellowship. Uh -huh. And they were saying, all the other gods. They are the works of men. There is no other god yes. except the one in heaven. None like him. None, None like him. Ah. I can imagine. So the king was there waiting for these guys to melt. Mm. He saw the first guy fall and then stand. He thought the guy was standing because of pain. <laughs> but then he saw that imagine. the guy was walking around like he was walking in Uhuru Park. Yeah. And, then, and then he saw that these guys were actually having a conversation. But the most strange thing was about to happen. What, what? now? As they were doing their rounds, uh -huh. a fourth person appeared. A fourth one? In the fire. I think I know the From fourth where? person. What? Who? I, I think I have an idea. Who? It's automatic. It's Daniel. <laughs> but Daniel? Daniel yeah, was see. not thrown in the fire. I thought he said, you know, like, get <laughs> 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 yeah, well, it. My boys were four, but Don't, yeah. don't <laughs> confuse children. Yeah? Oh. Don't confuse children. <laughs> Daniel was in his office. He was oh. in his state house. Yes, yes. Yeah, Daniel was in the office. It okay. was not Daniel who was actually in the fire. But anyway, that was a good attempt. Daniel was not thrown in the fire, but because nobody had discovered that, he did not bow down. Mm. The person who was in the fire was somebody that the king had never seen, but there was something about his face that actually showed that this person was God. Oh. In fact, mm -hmm. Bible scholars have said that the person, the fourth person in the fire was mm -hmm. Jesus Christ himself. Wow. Jesus? Yes. Wow. wow. So you know what happened? Mm -hmm. When the boys were thrown into the fire, mm -hmm. a fire that was supposed to kill them, instead of, um, of, uh, of them being burned by the fire, Jesus Christ showed up in the fire. Wow. And wow. they were actually having fellowship inside there. Oh, that would have been man. a nice place with vegetables. Yes. And to say amen. And to say amen, yeah. <laughs> now, the king was so shocked, and he started calling them out. He was like, but I can see four people. Mm. And he shouted, um, uh, Hananiah! No, sorry, he didn't call them Hananiah, because he had given them new oh, names. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah he called them, names. what was the name? Shadrach. Okay, Shadrach! And then Shadrach walked out of the fire. Oh. And then he said, um, uh, the other Meshach. name was Meshach. Meshach. And then Meshach yes. walked out of the fire. Abednego. And then Abednego walked out of the fire. Mm -hmm. And they came to him and they were like, but the, the fourth person mm -hmm. stayed in the fire. Hey. So the, the king asked, um, what is, you guys did not get burnt. And then he called them and he was smelling and there was, not, <laughs> there was no smell of smoke. Hmm. Wow. These guys were perfectly well. In fact, it's like the, it's like the fire had made them even cleaner. Hey. Eh, that hey. is so strange. <laughs> and the guy said, I have never, ever seen anything like this. Mm. I, I thought my God was the tallest. I, I thought my God was the healthiest. Mm. Kumbe. There is truly no other God mm. to be worshipped mm. other than the God of Shadrach, Meshach, Meshach and, and Abednego. Abednego. You guys, mm. you guys are trustworthy. Mm. You guys serve the only true God. And from today, mm. all the other gods, they are the, they works, are the works of, of men. men. Jesus, God, you are the most high God. God. And that's the end of my story. Wow. 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 It's amazing, Uncle Paul. Mm -hmm. The things God can do. I tell you. No man can do. 
Now, other than the name Belshazzar that you can't pronounce, <laughs> is there anything that you have learned? I have, I have picked something. Uh, mm -hmm. Children, you see, throughout the story, I was just uh, seeing the way God keeps his promises. Mm -hmm. And I want to tell you that indeed God keeps his promises. Oh, yes, yes. Uh, when you reflect on the story, I am sure uh, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, they trusted this God. Mm. And because they believed in him and mm. they had faith in him. Mm. And by the way, the Bible says when the righteous run to God, they are safe. Mm. Yes. When the righteous. Mm. And in their own understanding, they were right mm. when they were following God. Mm. And they, were, they knew they could not bow to any other God. Mm. So they didn't care even if they were going to be burnt or mm. not. But they knew that God will keep his promise. You know what is coming to my mind? Yes. Through the fire, ah, yeah. through, through the, the storm, storm, I will go. Our God keeps his promises. Yes. He protects. He, he shields us. Yes. That's Amen. true. Mm -hmm. Amen. I have learned something, children. Mm -hmm. God's word is true. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. These boys were in trouble mm -hmm. because the king was about to throw them in a big fire. Mm -hmm. But they remembered the word of God that was in their heart mm -hmm. and they trusted it. Yes. Mm. Because God had taught, they knew the word of God that says there is only one God. Yes. So there was no you shall going worship back. No other you will God. worship no other God mm -hmm. except the true God. Mm. And they were ready. Even when the king asked them when, whether they want to be thrown there and, and they were going to die, they said, even if God does not save us, mm. we know his word. Mm. And, sometime, and we could ask ourselves, Kwani, they were not afraid. Mm. They might have been afraid. Yes, it's not to true. be afraid. Mm. Mm. They were not even sure whether God would answer them the way they had hoped. Mm. Because sometimes God can say no. Mm. He can say yes, he can say wait. Mm. What was important for these boys is that the word of God, which they know is true, and they trusted that word. Mm. Today, trust in the word of God. Mm. It does not matter what you are going through. And from our story, because they trusted in God's word, which is true and amen, they were saved. Amen. Mm. Yes. So God keeps his promises. promises. Yes. Through the fire, through the storm, mm. he will walk with us. Yes. Mm. God's word is true. Mm. You can stand by that word. There is only one God. Mm. Yes. It doesn't matter who, what has said anything else. God's word is true. True. Mm. One of the best things that I also picked from this story mm -hmm. Mm. is that King Nebuchadnezzar, uh, Peter Moses is ah, no. ex, ex, ex no, 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 no. <laughs> Children, ex, ex that, that can't be my friend. <laughs> okay, sorry. So, King Nebuchadnezzar, a wicked king, a king who served idols, came to believe in God mm -hmm. because of what God did through the boys. So you see, God can actually use me, God mm. can actually use you, God can actually use children, to bring people to himself mm. through their faith. I think that for me stood out very, very much, wow. okay? So God keeps his promises. promises. We can trust him. Yes. His word is true. Whatever mm. is written in that word, you can stand on it. And mm. God can use our faith in him to actually draw people to himself. Mm. That is the end of wow. our story. Quite wow. an exciting story, children. Mm. and. We pray that this week you reflect on those three points. God's word, which is true and amen. He keeps his promises. Mm. And remember, your actions can bring others to know about this great God mm. that we serve. Now we welcome Wahura. She, he's, she's Wahura, Wahura to give us the memory verse of the day. Okay. Welcome. Hi, my name is Wahura Gyoko. And today we, I am going to read a Bible verse. Proverbs chapter 3, verse 5 to 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways, submit to him and he will make your paths straight. Thank you so much. Can we appreciate her? Oh, yes. yes yeah. Let's go. Kalamanda. Pop, 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 pop. Kalamanda. Pop, 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 pop. Senorita. Pop, 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 pop. Boom. Well done, Wahura. And just remind the rest of the children at home, if you want to take part in our program by reading the Bible or giving a memory verse, get in touch with us with the contacts that are displayed on your screen. And before we finish our lesson, we want to say thank you so much for supporting the work that we do here. 
for praying for us. We also do pray for you. And we miss you so much and we love you so much. And we are praying that you are keeping safe wherever you are. It's time now to tell God thank you for those many blessings. He has preserved us through all this pandemic. And we want to give our offertory just to say thank you mm. out of the many that he has given us. Our pay bill is 30, 30, 36. And the account is Sunday school. And Uncle Paul will bless the offertory today yes. and bless the children of the world. Okay. Mm. Let us pray. Our dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for your loving kindness to us is better than life. Thank you for the beautiful story of today of the four friends who stood um, and were not afraid. Well, they could have been afraid, but they stood their ground. They knew that your promises are true. They knew that they could stand on your word. They knew that their lives could actually count for something, could influence other people to believe in you. So Lord, we pray that you would equally teach us the same things in our hearts today and help us to stand firm in your, in your promise, in your word. Thank you, Lord, for the children who stretch out to give towards your work. Lord, you know their hearts, and for every hand that stretches out to give, we pray that, Lord, you would bless them and increase in their lives. Lord, you also remember them that are in need. And Lord, we pray that you visit them, every person. Let them know of your goodness, your greatness, your, your presence. Let them walk with you, Lord. And I pray that you will meet them at their point of needs for them that would be in dire need. And give them the joy of serving you, even through giving. Lift up their countenance, Lord, through whatever it is that they are going through to the glory and honor of your name. And Lord, we continue to commit the big project, the Children and Teen Center, into your able hands. Father, we pray that you breathe life into it. And as this program and many more programs go out, that many, many people, many children will be brought to the glory, will be brought to the knowledge of your kingdom. And your glory will fill their lives and they will worship you and honor you as the only true God. So we love you, Lord, and we honor you. We pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And now, children of God and parents and whoever is watching, may the Lord bless you, may the Lord keep you, may the Lord make his face to shine upon you, may the Lord be gracious to you, may the Lord turn favorably towards you and grant his peace. And may Christ, the Son of Righteousness, scatter the darkness from before your paths, and the blessings of God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with you now and forevermore. And all God's children say it. Amen. 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 So it was great. Um, it was great uh, doing a lesson with you guys. Yes. You know, we can trust the Lord and we can sing um, all the other gods. Amen. Sing you, yeah? Yes. Yeah. It doesn't matter how tall. It doesn't matter how unhealthy. Yes. Yes, there's only one God. Amen. Yes. All the other gods, they are the works of men, but you are the most high God, there is none like you. All the other gods, they are the works of men, but you are the most high God, there is none like you, Jehovah.